Schalt, Homeworld, Shati, an arid rocky world. It is known for its harsh environment, aggressive fauna, dangerous flora, and multiple bizarre anomalies. Place that kills the weak and ensures that only the strong can thrive. Schalt built their castles and settlements on top of numerous plateaus that are relatively common sight on the planet. Physical Characteristics Type Uphuman Height 2.1 meters Weight 200 to 220 kilograms Coloration Brown Rust Diet Omnivore Senses Standard Forms of communication Vocal Reproduction Life birth Pregnancy 9 months Lifespan 75 years Maturity 18 years Special traits Shalt are easily recognizable thanks to their horns and bone-like plates covering their body, giving them natural armor. In fact, the bone plates that cover their body are comparable to a standard Imperial Guard flak armor. Shalt have denser bones and greater muscle mass than standard humans. On average, Shalt are more prone to aggression and are usually less intelligent and single-minded compared to humans. Psychological Characteristic Shalt are a meritocratic warrior society. Physical strength and martial ability is highly valued among those people. They have also a strict code of honor, which usually leads them to meeting quick death in combat. Those who break the code are disgraced usually by ritual cutting of the horns, which don't grow back. Hornless are shunned and can never hold position of power or influence. Shalt see life of a warrior as most holy. Being warrior or someone who makes weapons for warriors are only respectable professions. Everything else is for slaves, cowards and disgraced filth. With coalition present, things have changed, but the stays towards non-warrior focused practices remain. Shalt pray to spirits of their ancestors and of their weapons. Because of their lack of ingenuity, they were one of the more primitive societies in Keshi cluster when they were encountered by the coalition. They don't like ranged combat and prefer to fight in melee any chance they get. History The history of Keshi Cluster is mostly a mystery, but it is known it was once unified, a federation, created most likely in the early days of Age of Strife, after the defeat of Men of Iron. Shalt were most likely intentionally created by the first Keshi Empire, and intended to serve as warrior caste of this government, before it fell to chaos and ruin, leaving their creations unattended. Shalt managed to secure Shati, most likely a garrison world of the First Empire, and place where they were created. Shalt are split into numerous clans, with Matriarch or Patriarch as their leader, chosen for their martial skill and physical strength. Those clans unite in form of kingdoms, with each kingdom possessing High Patriarch or High Martiarch leading them. Those clans and kingdoms waged wars between each other and other factions of the Keshi cluster, seeking glory and purpose, which was then denied with the fall of their creators. Shalt were on the level of late medieval period when Coalition made contact with them. Joining the Coalition 6802 Era of Unity 452nd year Millennium 41 It was thanks to hard work of Rehichi Commander 
Tsar Agron, who passed the trials of Schalt and showed the might of the Kolschen warriors. But Schalt kingdoms saw value in joining the coalition. Schalt were the first of Kreshi factions to join the coalition. Status in the coalition Puppet of the Tao Empire Schalt became puppet of the Tao, seeing themselves as warriors only. They passed the bothersome task of governance to Tao advisors, themselves focusing on keeping their warrior code and culture alive. It's important to note that Schalt understand this and aren't blind to that, but as long as Tao recognize their value as part of a fire caste and as warriors, they don't mind. In a way, the coalition allows them to fulfill their purpose. They were created to be soldiers. Now, finally, they have chance to be just that. Government Schalt High Kingdom A monarchy where the greatest of warriors, one of the greatest renown, sits on the top. Around him or her is the council of kings and queens, where rulers of minor kingdoms sit on the same council and compete for a position of a high king or high queen. Role within the coalition Schalt are warriors of the coalition. They don't produce valuable weapons, ships, or provide coalition with much in terms of resources. The only thing they want to do, and what they were made to do, is fight. Schalt auxiliary units can be seen all over the coalition. Many seek adventures as mercenaries, and their companies can be hired by the coalition directly to serve certain groups of interests. Schalt specialize in melee combat, but thanks to coalition training, they've proven to be good with rifles as well. Although they prefer carbines and close-range engagements, they are usually used as replacement for crew among Tau cadres. They've proven themselves great warriors and are eager to face the enemy. Many times they are sent into the meat grinder and die en masse. But Schalt don't mind. That's what they were made to be. To die in a battle with a blade in hand is the highest honor that they could ever hope to gain. And so they throw themselves into a brace of death, willingly. For the greater good.